Hello, guys. This video will show you how to connect ESR P Series PBS and ESR TG Gateway. After watching this video, you can use P Series PBS extensions to make outgoing calls through the ESR TG Gateway and receiving incoming calls from the TG Gateway to P Series PBS extensions. The main configurations are establishing ship peer trunk on both PCRS PBS and TG gateway, creating outbound route on PCRS PBS and IP to mobile on TG gateway, creating inbound route on PCRS PBS and mobile to IP in TG gateway. Part 1 establish ship peer trunk on both PCRS PBS and TG gateway. Log into the PCRS PBS web interface. Go to Extension and Chunk. Find Chunk. Click on Add. Set a chunk name. Select the chunk type with peer chunk. Set host name, IP, and domain with the TG Gateway IP address. and the port with TG Gateway UDP port. Then click on Save and Apply. Then wait for a few seconds and check the chunk status on the chunk page. If the chunk status shows checked, then ESTAR P Series PPS is connected to the ESTAR TG Gateway. Then log into the TG Gateway web interface. Go to Gateway, find the VOIP chunk, click on Add. Select chunk type with peer chunk. Set a name. Set the host name IP with the PCRS PPS IP address and the port with the PCRS UDP port. Click on Save and apply changes. Then wait for a few seconds and check the chunk status on the chunk chunk status page. If the status shows OK, then ESTAR TG gateway is connected to the ESTAR P series PBS. Part 2 Creating outbound route on P series PBS and IP to mobile on TG gateway. In this episode, I will show you four scenarios. Scenario 1. Allow all extensions to make outgoing calls through all of the SIM cards. Step 1. Creating an outbound route on PCRS PBS to allow extensions to reach the TG gateway. Go to Call Control, Outbound Route, click on Add, set a route name, Use the default pattern X dot. Select the peer chunk. Selected all of the extensions. Click on Save and Apply. Then go to TG Gateway web interface. Find the Gateway Mobile Group. Click on Add. Selected all of the JSON chunk. Click on Add and Apply. Then go to IP to Mobile. Click on Add. Set a name. And select call source with the peer chunk and call destination with the mobile group. Click on Save and Apply. Then all of the extensions of the PCRS PBS can make outbound calls through all of the SIM cards of the TG Gateway. Scenario 2. 
specific an extension to make outgoing calls through a specific SIM card. There is no need to create a new outbound route on PCRS PBS. Just add a new IP2 mobile on DG Gateway. Set in simple mode to know. Set a router name. Call source with peer chunk. And set an inbound caller pattern with extension 2000. And select the call destination with mobile chunk 1. Click on save and apply. Then create another one. Set the core source with the peer chunk and set an inbound color pattern with 2001. And set the core destination with mobile chunk 2. Click on save and apply. Then, when extension 2000 make outbound calls, it will slow SIM card 1. And extension 2001, it will slow SIM card 2. Scenario 3, specific an extension range to make outgoing calls through a specific SIM card. Click on Add. Set a simple mode to know. Set the call source with the peer chunk and set inbound color pattern with 2 triple X. Set the call destination with mobile chunk 1. Click on save and apply. Then extension from 2000 to 2999 only can make outgoing calls through SIM card 1. Scenario 4. Specific a court number to make outgoing calls through a specific SIM card. Click on Add. Set a simple mode to know. Set a root name. Select call source with the peer chunk. And set the DID number with 921234. And set the call destination with mobile chunk 1. Click on save and apply. Then add a new one. Set in simple mode to know. Select the call source with the peer chunk. And the DID set to 1081. Select mobile chunk 2, click on save and apply. Then when extensions dial 921234, the call will through SIM card 1. When extensions dial 108192, the call will through SIM card 2. If you want to limit a card number range, you can set the DID number with a Y card. For example, we set it to one dot. Then all of extensions dials number beginning from one will slow mobile chunk two. Part three, creating inbound route and mobile to IP. After finish this part, you can receive incoming calls from TG Gateway to PBS extensions. Log into the PCRS PBS web interface. Find the call control in bound root. Click on add. Set a root name. Select DID matching mode with DID pattern. Click on add and enter a DID number. 
this DID number will be used to match the incoming calls from the TG gateway. In this example, enter 2000. Select the peer chunk and set the destination to extension 2000. If you want incoming calls to queue or IVR, you can set here. Then click on Save and Apply. And click on Add a new one. Set a name. Use the default matching mode. Click on Add and set the pattern with 2001. Select the pure chunk and set the destination with extension 2001. Click on Save and Apply. Then log into TG Web Interface. Go to Gateway, Mobile to IP. Click on Add. Set a router name. Select call source with the mobile chunk 1 and call destination with the peer chunk. And set the hotline with 2000. Click on Save and Apply. And add a new one. Select call source with mobile chunk 2 and call destination with the peer chunk and set the whole line with 2001. Click on Save and Apply. When an incoming call to SIM card 1, the call will be routed to PBS extension 2000. And when the incoming calls to SIM card 2, the call will be routed to the PBS extensions 2001. Alright guys, this is what we have in this video. Thank <laughs> you.